Hello friends, my name is Sumit and I welcome all of you to BISPtrainings.com. This is my new video in ClickView development. As all of you know that ClickView is a BI tool and by using ClickView we can create rich dashboards and can create rich reports and it would be very helpful in data visualization data analysis so in continuation of that i would like to cover a topic which would be very useful for those guys who are, who have got their data stored or published on a web page and they would like to analyze the data directly from their web page without downloading or taking a backup or backing up that data on their system on their local system so in this video i will be going to demonstrate you same that how can we extract the data from a web page directly from a web page and how can we visualize the data by using click view so in order to in order that i'm using bsp solutions training calendar as you can see here these are the various training which have been published on the training calendar which will be published by bsptrainings.com and here we have got classes demo as well as regulars and we have got various columns like courses class data time prerequisites status and attended so that's a table and by using click view i would like to pull this table data into my click view and then I would like to prepare or I would like to visualize it by using bar charts or by using table box. So let's start for same. First, let me open click view. And within click view, I'm going to create a new click view document. I'll save it uh, named as demo three. And next, I'm going to load the data directly from a web page into click view. So for this, will take help of a script editor so click on edit a script and in edit a script you can see we have got a tab which is called web file so we are going to use this option in this video so I click on web files and I'll simple copy paste I copy this URL bisptrainings.com slash training schedule dot php I copy this URL and paste under internet files then click on next so it may take some time to load the data and once the data has been loaded we can see the various different tables like category if you look at this table if you look at this form it has got various sections first one is this section second is this one and third one is this section so here also we have table one table two as soon as I click on tables I switch tables and when I click on third table you can see I got the data complete data set in a tabular format along with the columns and then I click on finish so table load script has been added successfully I'll save it and click on reload when I click on reload I got a message 26 line fetched so there are total 26 records here if you count them you'll uh, it will be 26 records 26 trainings all together with demo and regular click on close and then we can add the uh, list boxes we can add the field so we have course and class we have course class date time prerequisites status and attend you can see attend class course date prerequisites status and time so all the fields are here so I'll add a class and a date and status status I'm not I'm not requiring status I need that's all so two list boxes I'm requiring classes and date so I'll add a class and a date that's a class and that's the date. if I want to create a table chart in this click view so right click new sheet object table box and then I add the fields class course first I add course class date status and time and ok and I got the data in tabular format so from here we can look at the tabular format. here also if I want to add a time I can add a list box and add a time list box so 
So I would like to find out that how many trainings we are going to uh, organize at 5 p.m. IST and we can look at the status as well. What's the status? What's the type? Whether it's a demo or it's a regular. Similar way if I would like to display, if I would like to uh, look at all the regular classes which are going to be held. So I can look at the dates. You can, I can look at the data by clicking on, by applying the filters here. Same way, if I would like to create a bar chart for representing the, I would like to create a bar chart which will display the total countings of regular and demo classes date wise. So for this, right click new sheet object chart and here I create a, I select bar chart show title in chart I uncheck this click on next and here my dimension will be date I want date dimension next and it will be count total count I'll say total count of class and paste ok and total classes and finish so from here I would be knowing that what are the total classes which are going to be held on which day. Now if I would like to cat I would like to look at the demo classes which are going to be held on each day on the specific dates mentioned date. So click on demo or regular. If I would like to customize it more we can do more customization onto it. So right click properties. First I can add the values on the data points. Then click on sorting and on y values descending order so sorting will be done based on the training based on the counts style i'll look at the style orientation style or i can choose at the 3d style so there is an option for 3d styles or this one so i look at the 3d style and the chart will be then presentation line width so there is nothing in presentation colors I'll choose multicolor multicolor access so I primary dimension secondary dimension we can choose we can look at the access secondary dimension access apply grids we can look at the grids we can display the grids show grids minor grids and font numbers if you want to change And finally, we have caption if you want to add any caption. So total classes, so it's already here. And I'll say wrap text and auto minimize. And OK. So the customization has been done. Now, if I made a selection at 5 p.m. IST, so I would be knowing that what are the classes going on, on at 5 p.m. IST on which day. So how many classes are going at 5 p.m. IST and what are the dates for the same. In similar way, if I want to look at the demo classes, so there are total demo classes. So there will be six demo classes will be going to held or which has already held on 4th of June. Four classes will be going to held, held on 11th of June and so on. So like this we can look at the we can visualize the data from a web page. So that's all in this video. If you have any queries you can write to us on www.bisptrainings.com. You can subscribe our YouTube channel if you want to know more videos on click view keep watching have a nice day goodbye